Seal Fest 2008, and here we are backstage. And uh, you're probably just getting off work, going home, preparing yourself mentally to come out to ACL Fest tonight and uh, catch some of the show. Finally, I tracked him down. Del the Funky Homo Sapien joins us. What's uh, happening? Backstage, man. I, it was hard work, but I got you. And I'm glad I got you back here, man. You doing all right? Yeah, a little bit tired from the show, man. Yeah. But I'm hanging. Working it, working it. Make sure you get what you want from me. Working it, exerting it. You're it now, fully immersed in it. So how was it uh, to perform out there in front of 40,000 people, man? Man, I'm, I'm not. I'm going to say it like this. I love it. I love it because there's a whole lot of people. I'm glad everybody came out and stuff. But I just treat it like any other show, man. That's, it, don't, it don't stun me, you know? Right. So you, know? you don't pull out any uh, big bag of tricks for big shows. You do it at every show. I, well, nah, I got I to gotta do a little bit more because there's more people. The stage right. is bigger, so... I, I do more because it's more to capture, you know, got to capture more people's attention. But, like, I'm not nervous by the, by the, the amount people. of people, you feel me? Stick, I'm at ease the far from intermediate. I can see the clip, I make beats a rip. Plus, freak the sh out of geeky. Let them meet the strip. I'm completely here. Now, I want y'all to groove me your feet to this. You know, I'll just be trying to make some music, you know what I'm right. saying? Well, with, I'm, our little, with our little uh, safety point I got, I'm trying to fiddle around on the computer, make some music. Yeah, man, I see that you're always working. You, you got your uh, iBook over here, and then you're always making music. Is this pretty much how you are 24 7? You're just always creating? Yep, pretty, pretty much, man. It's, when, the, when the computer came out, and you could start making music on the computer, it was a wrap. I mean, like, how long have you been like this? How long were you, you know, do you work 24-7? Has it been like that all your life or just more, more recently since you get into the computers and stuff? Um, well, honestly, I've, I've been into computers and hacking and stuff like that since I've been in the fifth and sixth grade. Mm -hmm. um, as far as music is concerned, no, about 10 years ago, I started studying music theory. And then from then, this came in. And I was like, man, I need to learn how to do this because this is going to be the future. Right. So I started working on this as well, and now it's the future. And <laughs> the future is here. And I'm, go I'm glad I did it. Put it that way. Be immersed in it, working it, working it. Make sure you get what you work from it. Working it, exerting it. You're it now, fully immersed in it. Oh, what are you waiting for to come out next? Like, I know you're already working on different systems that you have. What, what would be cool if, if they had on a computer that would really help you out? What are you looking for? Man, I'm going to tell you like this. Ableton Live is pretty much the best thing out there, and I I, I had to plug them like that, but yeah. <laughs> Sorry, man. Ableton Live, I don't see nothing better than that. That's perfection as far as I'm concerned. I could do everything I want. It's real stable. I could do more than I I used to imagine that I could do. You could try a little stuff and be like, damn, you could do that too? It just works real logical, so, you know, that I'm, I'm, I'm at ease with that, man. <laughs> I started studying music theory, man, because I wanted to have a good grasp on how to make some music work, you know what I'm saying? Because I felt like the people deserve more than that, and I felt like they was going to get sick of everything just coming out the way it is. And lo and behold, they sick of it, you know what right, I'm saying? Right. Like, I'm not buying it. I'm going to download it. I'm tired of this, <laughs> you know? So I, one of my things I'm trying to do, I'm just trying to make people more aware that it is some good artists out there, still artists out there to care about music. It's not all about just getting money. Right. You know? Pummeling beats, tunneling freaks, feel me black. I really rap, conceal the trap, I deal the pack. What kind of advice do you have for the kids like perhaps listening right now and uh, they like to make music at home on their computers? Do you have any advice for those kids out there? Yeah, learn something about music theory, man. A lot of people out there probably tell you, nah, there's no rules to music and da-da-da. There's rules to music. You can do it any way you want to, but music works a certain way, and that's the rule. You know what I'm saying? So you got to learn how it works. It's like you know, it's like your medium. You know what I'm saying? You got to know you, you got to know the tools of your medium to be able to make it work. Otherwise, you're just fumbling around. And there's a lot of people out there already doing that. So if you want to stand out, if you want to be more than mediocre. You know, just okay, then you gotta know something about what you're doing. And I guarantee you that'll probably take you further than anything else, you know? And be cool. 
You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't, you gotta be approachable. Don't be too big headed about what you can do, you know what I'm saying? Cause you don't know everything yet. So just learn, really. He's so far from an immediate. I can see the clip. I bet beats a rip. Plus freak the out of geeky. Let them meet the strip. I'm completely here. Now I want y'all to groove me your feet to this. What's coming up new for Dell, man? What can we look for in the near future, man? Um, I'm working on this joint with me and my man Tame One. Used to be with the Artifacts. And uh, we got an album coming out called Parallel Universe. So, you know what I'm saying? So that, that's pretty much done, actually. When we're going to be seeing that uh, before the end of the year? Um, you know what? A lot of these projects, I don't know because <laughs> you're too busy. Buying them records, so <laughs> you better really, it's not a feasible, um, it's not a feasible thing to do because y'all ain't buying them records. So a lot of people is like shutting down, quitting, and going out of business. Right. And it's gonna be gone in a minute. So y'all gotta start buying them records, man, or else you ain't gonna hear nothing <laughs> except except what you've been here, yeah. and then you gonna be mad. Yeah. But, I mean, we working on it now. To, to, to be honest, we right. working on trying to find an avenue now, but it's hard, man. Well, you're gonna uh, obviously you're gonna support that record and be out on tour, right? And playing some club dates and stuff. Um, well, you know, again, if they buy those, right? <laughs> I mean, come to that show. The touring is cool, you know, but I've, I've just been trying to slow my roll and right. work on put the more production side. You know, no, no, that's... but I'm yeah, of course I'm still touring, do those spot dates here and there. Working it, make sure you get what you want from it. Working it, exerting it, you're it now, fully immersed in it. I'm looking forward to some new stuff from you, man, and thanks for coming out to the festival. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with us this afternoon. Okay, thank you. Any Anything you want to plug before you uh, take off? Um, yeah, uh, get the new hieroglyphic stuff, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I ain't gonna plug nothing, man. <laughs> All right. With music, get Ableton Live, though, on the real, man, because that's, it's really good, okay? I'm Dell. I'm gonna say peace to y'all. Love y'all.